Welcome back to Will It Shoe. This week we'll be taking some scraps of denim from P Denim and putting them together in the same vein as one of our previous scrappy offcut videos. P Denim is an independent denim brand based right here in Sheffield with a focus on sustainably made children's wear. Although more recently they have also started making jeans for adults too. Goral was put in touch with P Denim through a mutual friend me, and were invited down to the workshop to see what went on. Conversations have been had about a collaboration shoe, but in the meantime, we thought we'd do a Willet Shoe episode with the scraps that they brought us. There are a variety of different denims, so we're going to go through each one, explain what makes them so special, and why P Denim chooses to use them. Starting with the simplest, we have the Ecru, which is just the natural beige colour of cotton. A vegetal sizing compound used in the dyeing process makes this completely biodegradable, non-toxic and microplastic free. Next up, we have the textbook Pure Blue. Also made from 100% GOTS certified organic cotton, this uses a special combination of Kytotex and fancy futuristic nitrogen dyeing technology to drastically reduce the chemicals by up to 60%, and also saving huge amounts of water that are often needed with cotton and dyeing processes. And then finally, we have the indigo and black denims, which using a combination of the GOT certified organic cotton and the vegetal sizing compound mentioned earlier, also includes another of the manufacturer's proprietary technologies called indigo juice, which when boiled down is basically the fact that they only really dye the yarn on the surface, which means that they fade a little bit easier to give people that faded indigo look that they so love. I am really excited to see what the workshop do with these, and I hope they do them in a size 10. It's the Ecru. The Ecru gets me straight away. I think if it was just indigo denim, then it would be a bit like, eh, patchwork denim shoes, but nah, the, the Ecru pops. As with some of the other fabric shoes, it just looks like such a good shoe. It's so well made. Um, it's not like super thick. It's kind of, I like the lightweight element of it compared to like a solid leather shoe. Oh, nice. Got the uh, P Denim logo on the back. That's a nice touch. These look genuinely wearable. I know we like to have fun on Willet Shoe and do some stupid stuff, but sometimes I think the shoes are just great. And 
a little birdie has just told me that these are actually going to go into a very, very limited production run, which is ace. Because, you know, the whole concept of this, yes, it's to have some fun, but also it's to find out if we can genuinely make marketable, wearable, quality shoes out of waste materials. And it's great to think that actually, yes, there's something going to market which is just made from scraps. Um, you know, like, yeah, like, new soles, there's new elements in there, like new calf line leather, but the bulk of the outer being made from completely waste material is just so cool. So, I'm very chuffed with that. Definitely one on my wish list. So yeah, let me know what you think in the comments as always. If you are a brand, maker, designer, craftsperson, anyone who makes something out of something and you found yourself with a little pile of offcuts or scrap materials, then just get in touch and have a little chat with us. I'll put an email address on screen for you to get in touch, but we're open to anything. We love collaborating and we'd love to see waste materials be turned into something valuable. If you're not a maker and you just like watching shoes get made, then make sure you subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.